Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children all ages, welcome to the Amazing Frog. Now, I've had a good night's sleep uh, and a couple drinks now, and I found this in the back of the uh, frog melt coffee, and it looks to be some kind of <laughs> coffee gun. Don't you want free coffee? Anyways. <laughs> I wonder if it's coffee or can I set it on fire? Oh, well. I'll leave those polar guys alone because what I was actually looking for back there is that used to be where some uh, canisters were. Uh, gas canisters. I was hoping to use them as a... Um, I don't see any here. What do you do with all the explosives? Oh, well. But... Mm, excuse me. So, that was interesting. Anyways, uh, what was I saying? Yes. Oh, now I'm... Well... That's one way to start a video, get stuck in the door. Anyways, what I was trying to say is I saw so a post randomly. Since I did my first video, I started looking at some people's posts that there's a GoPro. And I saw that in the up, updates, and I didn't think much of it. But uh, apparently there's one up there, I've been told. So I'm trying to get up there now. Hi there, sexy. You got the makeup just like me. Kind of. You just look better in it. Would you like free coffee? Free coffee for you. There you go. Oh, there's one up there. So they're up there. Oh, well, I got to get up there somehow. I'm not exactly sure this is supposed to work this way, but we're going to roll with it anyways, all right? This is one small step for mankind, one trip for frog kind. Hey, still pretty fast. All right, let's stand up. And ignition. All right, cool. Let's try to land it now. Control, control, and nailed it. All right, so if I unholster E. By the way, if I holster again, nope. See, so this is the second time this has happened. Occasionally, guns just don't register. <laughs> nice, uh glitching effect there all right hold on. if i put you down oh i see so I, if i pick up one i pick up both i get you so hold on a second if i pick you up <laughs> my mohawk's covering it up <laughs> it's a hidden camera a fail do not use oh look it even has the rca on the back <laughs> go poo be a big boy hold on a second well Mm. Let me uh, screenshot this. So whatever I look at, it looks at also, huh? Uh, but yeah, the RCA, that's the red, ye yellow, white there, is RCA. The white, yellow is just audio usually. I mean, the red, white is just audio. Oh, and the S video. Oh, I haven't seen one of these TVs forever. 13 channels of loveliness. But there you go. I got my uh, GoPro conveniently shaped. Hi, guys. You're on TV. It's a prank, bro. So, by the way, is it still in my head? Yes, it is. So, whatever I see, it sees. Even if I look at it. See if I get infinity going here. Hold on. Well, if, I, if my gun would work. Let me go get another gun somewhere. Oh, hold on. I haven't activated the guns yet. So this gun, by the way, is available without guns being activated. Because now guns are activated. So that coffee gun is just there regardless of whether you're a pacifist or not. There should be a gun spawner. Yep, yeah, right here. And you see he freaks out when he has the GoPro on. Interesting. Okay, there we go. I now have it on the wall. And if I do this, maybe? Oh, don't move now. Well, that works, too. I'm trying to get the affinity effect. I do this all the time at work, where if we set a source on its own source, it just ends up being infinity. A repeating image of itself forever and ever. Uh, I could almost get it, but I can't look at it. Ah, uh, can someone adjust the GoPro on my head? I think my mohawk's in the way. Sir! 
Can you help me? There you go. You, hold on a second. Get the wall. Yep. There you go. How are you doing? Thanks for supporting my... Yeah, by the way, where did you buy that t-shirt? Because I no longer have a shop. <laughs> Disney holds me over. Anyways. So there's that. I could almost get the affinity effect here. Yep, yep, a little bit further away. So if I walk away, walk towards it slowly. I think this might be the best I can do since I think my character is glitching out a little bit. There you go, that's a little bit better. Let me take a picture of that. Nice infinity going on there. Again, it would be better if you would stay put. There we go, how about that? There we go. Break the game. Break the game. That's right, protester, right? Anarchy. Why so serious? Woo. See, I'm head banging. The camera's head banging. Everyone's having fun. <laughs> oh. All right, the camera's finally settled down to a normal position, at least. Oh, well. But yeah. Anyways. So I got the GoPro, I got everything. I'm gonna quickly reset here. <laughs> uh, let's go to uh, exit, restart level. Boom cha da boom cha boom cha ba boom cha boom cha ba boom cha boom cha boom cha ba boom cha boom. Come on, look at me. Well, there goes that plan. I thought maybe if I give it gas, it'd go. But what's this? What's this? Something I can interact with. Oh, there it is. Launch codes. 7442444. The space rocket. Ah, so I was right all along. It was just like the old Ouya days. I told ya. So now I just need fuel. To the rocket. There we go. That should be a good start. Let me grab you. So that only do you set fire, you can get me to the... I said that was enough. Quit with the exploding. Anyways, it should be enough to get me to the wrong side of the fence. Let's go around it. Uh, maybe enough to get me to the moon? Again, in the old Ouya version, I think you had to get like 20 gas cans or something like that. So, but here we go. Bang, pow. Mm. Finally, we're going to go straight to the moon without the uh, subtle into window of domestic violence. So here we go. Around the corner. Ah, see, it even covered up. So now, oh, dang it. So yeah, there you go. There's the fuel fueling ometer. So what we got here? Do I actually have to pour it in? Oh, I just put it in there. That didn't raise up by much. Anyways, let's continue on. By the way, do you count as one? Oh, well, I'll blow you up later. Matter of fact, what I should do, if I was smart, and sometimes I like to think I am, let me go forth with my genius plan. Okay, so I got my grappling hook, which might not be enough or might not make it to the moon at all. Probably not. But I thought I'd get it anyways. But what I've been doing for the last 30 some odd minutes, probably not that long, but still it felt long. I've been, let's say, pulling a Jay Leno. What do I mean by that? I have been polishing my chin. I've been collecting cars. So, now my goal is to try to make all these explode somehow. Oh, 
So how am I going to make this explode other than just humping them? Well, now I'm kind of stuck. So uh, how many cars do I have here? And the problem is I don't know if I explode one, if they're all going to give me tanks or if the tanks are going to explode, et cetera, et cetera. But I can just pin them all together and see what happens. Hope for the best. Nothing else is gonna get loud. There we go, that should cause an explosion or two. Maybe I should stand back. Something's gonna give here. Maybe my eardrums. Uh it's getting loud! It's almost like a black hole in the middle. Let's see if I can get around this thing. and Because there's a couple cars that I haven't got into in the mix yet. And I need to remember again, I can now aim. Thank you guys again for changing the aim button. I haven't got the love bug involved yet. Run! I have no head. There we go. Which is a good thing. Then I won't be. Then I don't have to listen to all this. Oh, did I drop my gun? Where did my gun go? Dang it! I lost my grappling hook. You guys don't explode yet, okay? Nice to know it's nice and quiet over here. One of the benefits about now being able to use the scope is that I can now use the scope on this. Um, uh, sniper rifle here so I could do it from a safe distance and what I mean by safe distance is my ears won't explode but they will does that not count as a hit let's back away and get a better shot how about right there on the engine <sighs> let me get a better gun I think I'm stuck. Taking pictures for insurance purposes. Well, I tried jumping on it, shooting it with a sniper rifle. Oh, there was a gun thing right there this whole time. I'm an idiot. Anyways, I found the perfect thing to do it. Because what I'm going to do, go over here, set it on fire, and walk away. It didn't catch a fire. Set it on fire and walk away. Slowly back away, but still looking at the cool explosion. There's a action shot for you. All right, let me get all the uh, e. Let me get all the tanks here before they despawn. One downside is they're all buried underneath uh, burnt out cars, so that does make it a bit tricky. So maybe I should rethink this. Oh, what the hell? Come on. It's a bit of a mess, but it is one way to do it. Problem is, I keep have to pick up all this trash to get to the uh, ah, come on, the um, gas tanks. I think there's one more in that pile somewhere. So I didn't get a full one-to-one -one ratio, which makes me think some got exploded or some just didn't give me some. But at least I got all those guys out of the way finally. But I'm about halfway there. Yep, so one, two, three, four, five, maybe more. Don't know if there's five more because I did take a lot of cars on the on this explosion. 
Uh, let's see here. I think there's one more there, but it might just be a red door. In fact, I think it is just a red door. Yep. Let me just pin all this stuff to the roof here. I don't think there's anything left. It's almost like a... If you ever been to one of those car garages and they just have a bunch of random parts they put onto the uh, display, it just holstered a gun <laughs> on the display of the walls there. Anyway, so yeah, I'm about five more tanks away. Oh, well, that was a fun experiment that took longer than it probably should. Anyways, especially since there was a gun spawner right there. I'm an idiot. All right, I'll be back as soon as I get some more. Okay, that's weird. Uh, so, uh, while trying to get rid of a car here, I, uh, well, accidentally, I kind of purposely blew myself up trying to, you know, a rocket jump in Team Fortress 2? I was trying to do that. Anyways, I got a new car brought over here, and all of a sudden, when I died and came back, some of these cars came back as well. So, hmm. Uh, nope, that does no good. That works a bit better, but it's still not ideal. Uh, there we go. That should probably be the last one. Uh, let me holster my shotgun. Take it to space with me. Actually, my grappling hook should be here somewhere. It uh, stayed when I exploded. Oh, well, what a mess, though. But yeah, so that might explain why I was short a couple of gas cans uh, initially, is because some of them probably didn't technically explode. Come on, get... There we go. That looks like 100% to me. So if I stand on here... Oh. While I was lining myself up for an emotional speech... But apparently, NASA doesn't have time for emotional speeches. So let's just line up here. Okay, as we say in NASA, the third time's a charm. And get in there, get in there. Got in there. One small step, I already said it today. Uh, uh, fly me to the moon. Hey, there's actually citizens this time. Yeah, now this looks familiar. Ah, excuse me, just my headset there. Warning, impregnable barrier fence is active. I'll be the judge of that. Uh, back here used to be a secret base where you could actually find one of the like rare ooyahs. Aren't you looking cool? Watch out, I accidentally sent a garbage can your way. I want your facial hair. It matches my actual facial hair in real life. Uh, and some more Swindon t-shirts. Anyways, this is the airlock here. Can I open it up and kill everyone? Oh, what fun is that? All right, so what am I doing here? Here's some, what's this? Oh, is this to teleport me outside safely? Again, what fun is that? Ooh, what's this? Looks like a dressing one. Oh, I could actually change. Uh, sure. Let me just take this thing off. And then put my tutu back on. Nice. So it's almost like a custom... Oh, by the way, you could actually have the Trump hair. Oh, that's close, but no, I mean here. So, anyways. Uh, mohawk, glasses. Just straight down the line. There's one downside to this. I get stuck exiting sometimes. So, yeah. Tutu is not the most elegant thing in Amazing Frog, which is slightly ironic given the nature of what a tutu, a person who wears a tutu usually has. I'll be back with you as soon as I get off the can. There we go. All right, so where am I? And by the way, did I have to be an astronaut, have the, the uh, space suit on to survive space? Ooh, they have drones again. Yep, hi guys. Don't mind me. Keep doing uh, your work. So let's see. Ooh, we have some satellite dishes out here. Oh, satellite dishes and uh, cell phone towers. 
Hi. Looks to be in working order. Hey, Space Invaders! <laughs> Hold on. Oh, I have googly eyes. Would you look at that? And not googly eyes, but actual. So that's what that's over there probably is. Oh, do they have... Oh, they have the damn jumping puzzle again. Oh, fudge me. Over there. I'm pretty sure, like last time, this is where you get Han's costume at. Or not Han's, Boba Fett. I killed Han's to... Han to get it. So, I was the original Kylo Ren. Spoiler warning. Uh, come on, let's go to Space Invaders. So, each one of these should be their own little drones, huh? Yep. Oh, look, a space cr a site. A uh, crash site. Excuse me. I see, and they're all labeled. So the last one I was in was D. This is C. So that, uh, if I had to guess, there's probably two more. Is there any logs in there? About how they lost their uh, suits? Anyway. So what else we got there? So that was... There's one missing. What's this over here? Oh, let's just go outside. Uh, what does this say? Methane extractor. That because all the farting? And there's some more. I like this space lab look. So let's see if I can go outside and breathe. I just made a giant circle. Dang it! What's this? Ah, nothing fancy. Let's go back this way. I'll figure out how to open up the airlock and kill us all here in a little bit. Oh, here it is. Giant button that does so. All right, everyone, take a deep breath. Yep, heads explode. <laughs> and they'll do theirs. Oh, that's fun. I just killed a lot of people. Okay, fine. I get the idea. I have to have a spacesuit on. Grumble, grumble, grumble. Can I just wear the space uh, helmet, or do I have to have the whole thing? Well, that mistake cost many a frog soul, but that's fine. Now that I'm wearing a space helmet, I think I should be okay. Less time to test out theory. Yep, I'm fine. See, those other guys should have known better. I mean, to trust someone like me. Ha! All right, so what's all this stuff here? Okay, so that's uh, that's probably A then. So A, B, uh, yeah. A's there. B, C, and D is inside. Uh, this is some kind of gem collector. Okay, so that means I have to go out and explore and find new fascinating worlds and sleep with many, many aliens. If that's one thing Captain T. Kirk has taught me, it's that banging alien. Is there any trash on this moon? Not to change the subject. But yeah, so I wonder if there's a UFO up there. And, and I know probably the answer already because they didn't, they took care of it last time. But there was a hop mechanic I used to exploit in the Ouya version. And just to confirm. Nope. So I can't really jump in this one. Because you used to be able to hop in the uh, uh, moon buggy. And you'd hop faster than you fall, so you'd be able to hop, 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 hop your way into the sky. That's how I used to get to the UFO in the old old days. Come on, vertical. Damn you, gravity, you win again. But this time, let's use it to our advantage. Watch out, guys. Well, damn. That's your fault, Bob. Well, he's dead, Jim. Damn it, Jim. Do you know somewhere where I can get a grappling hook? All right. This seems... Here I go, off into nothingness. Let's go this way into nothingness, because I think there's a costume over there. Here we go. Just got to get some altitude, and I'll be fine. That looks like an interesting rock. Again, I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to be looking for a crystal somewhere. Fastest travel on the moon. 
with the best view of my crotch. All right, let's see if I can get up this hill. Because, again, this is a lot faster than walking. Just hard to watch. All right, there we go. I am finally stopped. All right, so where? It's over there. And I don't think... Ah, oh, dang it. Oh, hey, a gun uh, spawner. Sweet. Nah. Come on, give me something new. That'll work. Lasers on the moon. And what am I aiming at? Oh, well, let's holster this one. Keep that one on hand. Oh, there's the... Ah, they put in it. So that's what they mean by impregnable uh, barrier. And again, I don't believe it till I die from it. Looks like the laser has a low point here. I'm going to shoot for it. Ha ha! Impregnable my butt. Which is now over there. About a mile away from my head. Dang it! Alright. Maybe it's impregnable. Darn things wearing a condom, apparently. I see the multicolored. So yellow, green, purple, blue, by your powers combined, I am, um, yes. Uh, Captain Crotch, uh, Crotch Pants. Excuse me. Mike got a little bit funky there. And now I'm stuck. I'm off to a brilliant start. Well, what is this pointing at? Hi, will you kill me? Are you trying to mine or something? Hmm. Well, let's test it. I'm beginning to think lasers are bad. Oh, fuck. Is that a... Fuck. Fuck. New way to die. New way to die. Run. Nope. 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 Not gonna eat me. Fuck. There's more of them. Damn it, Jim. Just like the start of Ready... Not Ready Player One, but Red Shirts. Where's Reba McIntyre when you need her? Is anyone getting these outdated references? Oh, the... Oh, he got me. Damn it. Something new for me to fart out of. No. Wow. I did not see those coming. Ah, uh, by the way, read Red Shirts. The great story. I'll change the way you think about other stories. Ah, uh, shoot. It's getting late. <laughs> and I haven't found one crystal. Uh, I have found new ways to die, though. Which I think is equally impressive. So I need to get me a grappling hook to see what I could do with those guys. I need a blimp. Well, a blimp won't work in space. But still, I want to be able to transport those guys like I do the Megalodon. Or, uh, ooh, console command. So I could have the Megalodon fight them. Even though, how would that work since the Megalodon's on water and they're clearly not? So, yeah. Let me at least find one crystal and then I can continue the search in the next amazing frog video. Hey, look, a viewpoint. There we go. Get some speed. And here we are. No cookie on this one? No. Oh. That's awfully tall. Virgin, how high up can I go? Oh, that's it. All right, I was hoping to see the UFO up top. Because I think they probably moved it here into space now that this is available. Hey, look, there's the Earth. But yeah, way up there, I bet you, is El Moon. Is it the UFO? Oh, 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 oh. Is this near the lasers? I see something off in the distance. Oh, hey. Hey, it's that crashed ship I went near as, uh, yeah, this guy. 
There's another gun spawner up there. Is one of the crystals hidden in here, Mr. CD? There's something hidden in here. A football. And the Illuminati symbol. Hold on, let me take a picture here. To remember my fond times and have evidence against them. You cannot lie anymore. Anyways, can I exit out this way? Probably if I had skills. Oh, what's this though? Hey, the camera. So I could do some nice... Uh, get. There you go. Toss the football in the air. By the way, I'm pretty sure they've done that. I know they've done golf on the moon. So there you go. Space. The final frontier. These are the voyages of a drunk bastard with way too much free time on his hand. Oh, no, that's what you get to. I bet you dollars to Betsy. Uh, that's where the... Can I holster the camera? I can. Oh, look at that. Butt zoom. That's what I always zoom in on. <laughs> Stop. Uh, start, start. Mm, yeah. Anyways, uh, I bet you that asteroid up there is where you get the uh, Boba Fett costume from. So... Anyways, problem is, oh, excuse me, I don't know how to really, uh, oh, there's another trampoline, uh, how to get up there effectively. Uh, like I said before, many times before, oh, I don't know how to do the jump mechanic very well. So, that's my one downfall in a game where that's very, what the hell's that? Hold on a second, is that a jetpack? Oh, not a jetpack, but the gas canister. Because there is a legitimate uh, jetpack somewhere around here. I've seen it in some of the uh, screenshots. Uh, K, no, K-E. Dang it, I want to keep the camera. How else am I supposed to do cinematics? All right, here we go. This is a bad idea, but that's what I'm full of. There we go. And let me upright myself. Dang it, almost. All right, let's get... Thing I just went down. All right, hold on, hold on. The problem is, as soon as I jump, which is my instinct here, uh, the canister goes off. So I need to find myself a good area to start. Oh well, let's just do it from here. Let it spin naturally. Nope. There you go. Need to find that real sp Ah, Failure! Anyways, let's go back to camp. Wow, look at the speed I got. Things does- this does pretty well as a vertical- Ah, uh, not vertical, horizontal uh, engine. There's again that uh, other buggy I was on. Hey, there's the space evaders. Can- I what happens if I actually hit them? Oh, that exploded. Gave me a lot more boost than when it was what it was normally used for. Ooh, what's that over there? Oh, I think that's just a satellite. I mean, a uh, cell phone tower. But yeah, again, with the moon, the fun part is the low gravity. Because you can just catch so much speed. But I thought I saw something on the ground here, other than the astronauts. Nope, it was just the astronauts and the um, a gun spawner. Oh, yeah. Run, bitches, run. Anyways, again, vote for me in the election. I mean, what other uh, mayoral candidate ends up on the moon with you? I mean, this is one hell of a campaign stunt. You know how much this costs? Better get a good uh, photo op. Here's one for you. Ah, dang it. This is a lot heavier than it normally was. I used to be able to... I mean, as a person, I float for miles. But this thing has actual Earth gravity. Kind of. Almost got some momentum to fly there. Taking a random picture. There we go. Again, always take pictures. It's the way you keep memories. 
Alright, let's get some speed here. And the moon, you get enough speed, you actually take off. Because of the low gravity, there we go. Watch out below! Oh yeah, I forget these things crash, don't they? Can you imagine this in VR? Hold on a second. Ow. Well, that looks painful. Um. Yeah. Don't know how to quite to explain this to the constitu constitu it, con the people who are voting for me. But it looks like I'm humping the vehicle. That's how much I love space travel. I actually love space travel. Literally. Give me a couple seconds here. Ah, anyways. Okay, let me get out of here. What I was stopping for was I saw this guy here. Doom. Let's holster it. Oh, no, oh, yeah, I forgot I had my laser. All right, let's get this. Holster it. And now, let's go over here. And again, I gotta remember not to jump. Which is a problem. That's the only way you can get to those guys. Oh, well, forget it. Here we go. Straight up. The stars are a lot closer than they look. Oops. I got too much speed. No. Yep. Many ways to die on the moon. I'm discovering them all. All right. I'm going to have to call this video early here because I'm going to come back. You better leave bucks to Betty. Whatever that phrase is. Damn airlock. Anyways. <laughs> That I'll be back. Because I still have to, A, find these guys, as well as all the other hidden gems. Mm. On the moon. So. Oh, uh, I don't know what I... Do I actually get a proper jetpack, maybe, when I get all the gems? That might be it. Anyways, with all that there, you can see my sexy legs there on the TV to the left. I'll end the video here. So, again, made it to the moon. So now I should be able to get here on a regular basis. So now I can explore it fully and hopefully find a grappling hook and have some fun with astronauts in low gravity. All that aside, uh, I'll end the video here. Again, it's only been two hours. So yeah, this is a typical, uh, a pretty short record session for me. But then again, this has been two days straight. I got to go to Vegas. So I'm ending the video here because of that. Wish me luck. If I win any money, you probably won't see me again. Just kidding. Uh, if you do, I'll probably have better record equipment. Anyways, all that drunken rambling aside, um, I gotta go pack for Vegas. Thanks again for watching. Any suggestions on what you want to see me do, uh, feel free to comment down below. Uh, otherwise, uh, thanks again for watching and see you next time.